Hello, this is Jess, and this is her Year 11 selfie project. <laughs> The key theme of my final piece was about selfies. I wanted to incorporate um, the interactive side of it and how it becomes a lot more interactive when it's something that you can physically be a part of. I wanted to work on the idea of how in most selfies there are always the common themes that people interpret and that everyone seems to be taking the same facial expressions in the same gestures of the same angle of a photo. So to put it into something like this, it then turns the person every and everyone who gets into it Although they're completely different people, it's still in the same scenario and the same concept, just like a selfie is. And the process included having a picture of a of a Barbie in a studio, and then editing that photo over someone else's already made selfie, where they were taking a bathroom selfie, which is one of those generic photos. And the photo then goes from being as a 2D image to a partly 3D image, then being in an interpretative 3D image, where if it was in a situation where it would be in a gallery, then the actual viewer themselves can then interact with the image and be a part of it, making more and more photos as you go along. Contemporary British photographer Gillian Waring was one of my inspirations for my final piece, um, especially in her series of self-portraits as members of her family. Waring uses silicon masks to cover her appearances and to pose as other people, whereas in my final project I used a board to cover the person's appearance but by still being themselves. I was interested in how you can take a selfie without actually being present within the image itself. How you can take pictures of stuff that you're passionate about and about stuff that reminds other people about you, but you don't actually have to be in the picture. I also looked at that as being someone who might have passed and how you can go around places where, they, where that person has lived or that, pla or that person has been and look at stuff that they love. They might not presently be standing there, but everything that they love is still there, so technically they're still present. Time and like, um, and no one realized it was mine because it was like just on the side, and there was those like, six formers like messing around in it, like walking around. Like, I don't know who this is, and I was like, 